The United States Marine Corps, I was a soprano bugler, musician with the Commandant's Own United States Marine Drum Bugle Corps, Marine Barracks 8th and I, Washington, D.C. I was an avionics electronics technician, and I served in Naval Station Mayport and NAS Whidbey Island, Washington State. I was in the United States Navy. I was a hospital foreman, and I served in Iraq, Afghanistan, and plenty of other countries. I talked to some people who had graduated from Alvernia, some of the nurses in Reading Hospital that I know, and they couldn't be happier with the program, so uh, it was an easy decision. In the state of Pennsylvania, there's a lot, or at least in this area, there's a lot of different schools within the area. Alvernia was the closest, and as, upon further inspection, I found that the criminal justice program was, was better than a lot of the other schools. Uh, Vernier helped me as a veteran, uh, just mainly the community. You're, uh, more, you're more accepted being a veteran. A great environment to be in, and they just welcome veterans with open arms, so I'm glad to be here. When I talked to admissions, and she sent me straight to Jason, and Jason walked me through the whole thing, and it's just been easy from there. I mean, I just give him a piece of paper every semester with the classes I want, and it goes through. Two weeks later, I get a confirmation letter from out, uh, from the VA saying everything's good to go and I haven't had any complications so it's been really great. Patience. Patience is number one when, when you're applying for anything, either for jobs, schools, auto loans, anything. Be organized, make sure you have everything that you need and everything will run smoothly. My advice to other, other veterans who are looking in the schools would basically just be to do their research, um, network and talk to a lot of people, figure out what they want to do, um, talk to some of the professors, email, they always have it on the website.